Hi everyone and welcome to my channel Lilies and Blush. My name is Suzanne and thank you so much for joining me for today's weekly wax melt basket video. Um, this is my empties basket and we'll go over this first and then we'll go over the ones that I'll be melting this coming week. So um, first, so I have my little list of notes to remember where I melted things and how I liked things because my memory sucks completely. So let's start with this one. A uh, happy snowman, fresh snow, shredded carrots, candy, ginger, and peppermint twists from vanilla wax. The vanilla wax. Villainous wax. Wow. I melted this one in the bedroom and I remember really liking it. It was different. The ginger and like carrot scent with the peppermint and like fresh snowy like clean scent was was interesting it was interesting um oh then we have frosty nights i melt frosty winter nights so i have one more of these that's gonna be in my next basket as well um so i'll finally be done with these ones but i melted them in the bathroom and bedroom and they're great like there is a good scent it's like a good pepperminty not pepperminty maybe just like menty in general like menthol-y menty smell um, it definitely smells like the smell you want when you're sick. So, you know, maybe I should hold on to that other one unless for like sick days or something. But hopefully we don't have any of those cross fingers. Um, okay. And then we have Happy Christmas from Villainous Wax, Ruby Red Candy Apples, Pine Tree, and Fresh Snow. I remember really liking this one. And I melted it in the bedroom, yeah. Mm, that smells so good in the bag still. I would definitely want this again. It was just such a good scent. It kind of reminded me of that apple scent that everybody likes from Bath and Body Works. They smelled it once and it was pretty good. It kind of reminds me of that a little bit. Um, Big Daddy, again, Villainous Wax. Salty Ocean Floors, Metal Diving Suits, and Gunpowder was pretty good. Or super good. I loved it again. But this, when I melted it in the bathroom, it was really great. When I melted it in the living room, I was getting an odd note from it sometimes. But that might have just been me. It's just a nice, like, musky, manly scent, which I love. Um, and then we have Fantasy Wax, the Santa Claus Gingerbread. This was so good. It did not, like, it wasn't as, like, gingerbready as I thought it was going to be. It was just, but it was still such a good, like subtle baked good scent and it just in general made the bedroom smell really homey i'm pretty sure that's yeah the bedroom yeah i wrote so yummy next to it <laughs> it was so yummy it was like it was just felt so homey in the bedroom it was so nice i really really liked it uh fantasy wax buddy the elf which is the magical blend of candy and soda pop bubbles i think this one was also nope this was the living room this is pretty good in the living room um Fantasy Wax, more times out of than not, really do give me a good scent throw in my living room because um, I just, sometimes other wax, I just, or some, just in general, it really doesn't matter the brand. I don't get a good throw in my living room, I think, just because it's such a huge space. Um, so if you have any tips for that, <laughs> I've like tried so many things like moving it around to different places in a house, but I only have so many surfaces where I'm willing to keep it just because of like, you know, child running around, potentially bumping into it and stuff. But like, I don't know. The only place I think I haven't tried is putting it in the dining room. I'm like looking around right now at like places I could put it, but it's a pretty central. It's like in the middle of the living room between the kitchen and the living room. It's like really like right in the middle. And I don't know where else to put it to really get a better scent through, but it is a really large space um so i don't know but this one still came across really well and like like i said more times that i'm not fantasy wax i can at least smell them sometimes i can't smell some at all and then i'll like melt another part of it in the bedroom and i can smell it great so i i know it's the living room i know it's the space but yeah but more times that i'm not i can at least know that if i put a fantasy wax one in the living room that i'll be able to smell it at least a little bit like as i'm you know around it in that surrounding area closer to it um, so Fantasy Wax, Mickey's Once Upon a 
Pond at Christmas, which was winter, winter candy apple type. See, this is what that, uh, I just lost it. <laughs> winter candy apple is what I thought the uh, happy Christmas one, yeah, happy Christmas smelled a little bit like was this. Um, but I really like this one too. And then, mm, that's so good. This one's like a little sweeter and I feel like closer to the actual winter candy apple. Whereas the other one was definitely a little like less sweet. Um, living room and again, good was next to it. So really good. And then we have Fantasy Wax Claws, vanilla butter and sugar cookies. My favorite things. Like I've been so obsessed with butter cookies lately. Oh, it smells so good. Oh, I want sugar cookies now. That literally is smelling that right now literally smelled exactly like those sugar cookies you can get at the grocery store and the soft ones with the icing i love those i have an obsession with them they're so good uh this one yeah it was the bedroom yep i remember that i always like doing the bed the bacon scents in the bedroom because then i can go in there to read and it just smells so yummy in there uh runaway railway salted caramel fresh ginger and frosted sugar cookies my hair is stuck to it um this one was really good too bathroom yeah because the smaller ones they did in the bathroom I'm trying to remember mm, yeah i remember this one in the bathroom now i'm not always like fully paying attention because i usually melt one melt for like the most of the day so i don't usually switch out melts in the middle of the day um but yeah so then i'm kind of like just throw one in and then that's it for the day but I remember that one, like, walking into the bathroom and being like, oh, what, what was that one again? Uh, Fantasy Wax, A Christmas Carol, Eggnog, not whatever I thought it was before. <laughs> the last time I did a video has, like, the writing on it. I was, like, being blind and couldn't read it, apparently. Um, a Christmas Carol. Sorry, I'm just looking at the list. There you are, living room. Oh, I remember this. I remember melting this and then walking by and being like, eggnog? Like, do we have eggnog? <laughs> Someone drinking eggnog. I'm the only person in the house that drinks eggnog too. So I was like, <laughs> I was like, wow, that really, cause like in the, in here, it's got those like notes to it, but like on warm, it straight up did smell like eggnog. I for real was like, I really kind of want eggnog again now. Um, I just finished off the last of the eggnog around um, New Year's. And so I was like, kind of sad. I was like, I kind of want more. Uh, Festive AF, the rum soap crunch cake, butterscotch drizzles and toasted marshmallows. I remember the butterscotchy smell for this one in the bathroom. Yeah, that butterscotch smells good. Uh, and then we have Lady Croft, which is this, I will have to say. I did melt for like two days because it, it, the scent was so strong. And then it was so strong that even on cold like it had gone cold and i just hadn't removed it yet to put in a new one and i was still smelling the scent like it was so good so amazing i want a thousand of these like a thousand hundred of these ancient sandalwood roasting charcoal tonka beans and leather straps i mean it literally just smells so yummy it's so yummy like i was really getting the like sandalwood almost more like an oceany type vibe in the bathroom and it was like kind of cold in there too so it just like added to the feeling of like outdoors in the winter like i don't know it was just giving me a whole vibe and i loved it i adored it i was like what else am i missing okay last cup and then i'll do the other bag so fantasy wax martha mayhew's spiced cranberries this was the bedroom mm. That smells so good. It reminds me of this scent my aunt used to put in the bathroom. And it was always super, like, nostalgic and yummy for me. So, I remember this. That's what that always smells like to me. Uh, Spirit Oasis Vanilla Wax. Not really sure what these scent notes are, but it is delicious. Mm. Really, like, cleany kind of scent. Uh, Spirit Oasis was the living room for two days. Yeah, I split this into two and did two days in a row of spirit spirit a weed sis a swa 
Uh, Christmas time is here. Fir tree, apple cider, cinnamon, and pumpkin bread. And again, this was, of course, in the bathroom, right? One second. I'm, like, looking. Oh, there it is. Christmas time. Yep. I, like, shortened the names a little bit. Oh, I can really smell the fur on this again. Well, it's yummy, as always. And then Winter Wonderland, Sweet Peppermint, Creamy Vanilla, and Whipped Cream. And again, this one was the bathroom. I'm just double checking. Where are you, Winter Wonderland? Winter Nights. Ah, there it is, down in the very bottom, bathroom. Mmm, that smells really good in there, too. I don't remember this one being really sweet, either, so that was kind of nice. Because I was expecting it to be super sweet. But that is my empties then. Ah, I'm like losing the garbage. It's okay. That doesn't matter. Okay. So now, on to what I'm melting this week. Okay. So, I, am, I basically put all the last of my winter Christmas scents in here. And then reorganized my wax again so i'll be kind of just melting regular stuff but this will be the last of my winter scents um i'm sure i'll get some like valentine's day scents here soon and things like that that i'll probably melt through february and march um and then maybe some like spring stuff and keep maybe save some of the summer stuff for summer but otherwise i'll i'll probably just melt whatever whenever from here on out um so let's get started let me unload and then I can reload the basket when, as I finish each set of wax. Got a lot of shapes left over. I think these are most of the vanillinous wax, um, like, uh, advent calendar ones that I thought were very, like, Christmassy or wintry vibes so that's what's left of those and then a few from other things but yeah uh let's dive into it so we got frozen heart so this will be for the bathroom sweet and full floral love spell type mixed with icy peppermint mm. Ooh, i'm getting like the sweet and floral and then the peppermint just goes right up your nose like and like chill, like I'm getting like a, I feel like chill in my nose. Mm, I like that a lot. I definitely have to save that for a day that maybe I come home from work with a headache or something. I'll have to think about that because that would be really yummy. And actually, I maybe not melt that in the bed bathroom. Maybe I'll melt that in the bedroom instead. Uh, Banshee Flight, again, a not or from Bonus Wax and No Scent Notes. This is from the um mystery bundle I got from them. Mm, this is so like crisp, clean. I don't know how to describe it exactly, but I'm definitely again getting that like cold kind of feeling. And then it's just like really clean, like a good, not necessarily like a laundry laundry scent, but kind of like a laundry scent. Really like that baby doll cranberries and cinnamon spiced vanilla i believe this a rag doll not baby doll this is rag doll this is from the um advent calendar and it's obviously like a little sally one i'll pull it out so you can see there's the little jack head in there super cute mm. that smells yummy Mm, I can definitely smell the cinnamon vanilla. Which is like that hint of cranberry. Oh, it smells so yummy. Okay, state of mind. Maple toddy fried donuts and warm apple cider. Oh, that is like straight maple to your nose. Whoa, I'm like dropping everything. Uh, this is definitely straight maple to your nose. And then I'm definitely getting that apple cider kind of smell too. Oh yeah, this smells like a hayride. This is what this reminds me of. Like going, when I smell it, I'm like, oh, I'm going on a on a hayride at a fall farm kind of thing. Um, you're a mean one. Fizzy soda pop bubbles, candy canes, sweet syrup, and sugar crystals. I believe this was also part of the advent calendar if I'm remembering properly. 
yeah definitely there's that fizzy soda smell so it's like the yeah it definitely smells like soda like when you make your own like that smell the bub the stuff that makes the bubbles i don't know because i've never made my own soda but i have smelled it when other people have uh some things never change pumpkin fall leaves brisk breeze and autumn spices this was from frozen subscription box mm. yeah this straight smells like a fall candle whoa i like whistled for my teeth um sorry about that yeah this smells like a fall candle super yummy then we've got forest of narnia eucalyptus oak moss cedar and frosted mini uh or frosted mini frosted mint and this was from the advent oh i'm getting like plant vibes must be the moss now i'm getting the mint but i'm definitely still getting heavy moss so i am intrigued to melt this because i'm like wondering how it's gonna come out i'm not really getting eucalyptus or cedar i'm getting the oak moss with like mint and it's very intriguing and earthy and i'm not usually a fan of the super earthy scents but we'll see um i am found frozen fruit slices glacier water sweetened cinnamon loaf and self-loved again from the frozen subscription box Ooh, that is sweet sweetened Oh, I'm getting the fruit and the sweet really good. Wow, that is intriguing. Again, another one I'm very intrigued by and want to see how it is on warm because that's really interesting. I'm going to bring you guys down a bit because I feel like I'm really far away. Okay, then we have the cups. So we have here Brewster's Signature Roast, an Animal Crossing themed one. Uh, that perfect coffee house scent with extra pigeon milk, which can be kind of weird. <laughs> but so pretty. Oh, straight. It smells like a, it smells like a Starbucks. Like you walk in and they just put out the baked goods and then like you've got the coffee going. Like it, it does. It smells like a coffee house. It's just so good. But I go to Starbucks indoors the most. Uh drive through coffee places are super popular here in Washington. So I never get to be like inside unless I go to a Starbucks. So I don't really go to like Whidbey's Coffee or like, oh, what is one of the other one or any of the other like indoor places we have around here. It's just like Starbucks and then I go to the outdoor ones that are just drive throughs Um, so yeah, but that straight up smells like a Starbucks. Fantasy Wax, uh, cotton headed, cotton headed ninny muggin. Muggins. I can't even say it. I love this so much. Uh, sweet coconut and vanilla frosting. It's so pretty. I really, really love the glitter on this one. It is gorgeous. Oh, it smells so yummy. I just want to like save this one. I don't even want to melt it. I just want to save it forever. The vanilla frosting and the coconut. It, oh, it smells like deliciousness. Like like cream cheese cookies like just oh so yummy like no it smells like red velvet cake with cream cheese frosting like that's straight up what it smells like like cream cheese frosting and it's on some decadent red velvet cake and i'm like drooling oh so so excited about that one fantasy wax smells little cindy lou who peppermint candy canes i've kind of been hoarding this one because i love this smell so much i need a billion more of them and i oh no i i did order i think two or three uh from the i believe this scent is the scent that is now or maybe it's not peppermint candy cane maybe it's a different one i know there's a peppermint smell that scent that is now a main scent and i can't remember if it's this one or if it was a different peppermint scent but Whichever one it was. I mean, I love all peppermint scents, but this one is so good. Straight up smells like a candy cane. Whoa, I'm losing stuff. Oh, I lost a candy cane. No, come back, candy cane. The deco is so cute. This straight up smells like a candy cane, and I love it so much. Um, I was trying to hoard that one, but I think I bought more of the other, of the peppermint scent that is now a core scent, and I'm excited about that to get here because then I'll have more. 
uh, Eloise at Christmas time sweater weather type. My brain is just not functioning tonight. I'm filming kind of later than I normally do, so that could possibly be why. And I really haven't had caffeine today, so which is good for me. But um, this is so cute. I love this so much. Mmm, I really like this sweater weather type. Oh my god, I literally just breathed in a. <laughs> Oh my god, I almost breathed in completely one of the little deco bins. <laughs> I literally felt it starting to go up my nose. I was like, no, no, back off. Um, yeah, I got um, <laughs> sweater weather. It is yummy. It is very yummy. So yummy, I almost snorted <laughs> deco bins. Okay, fantasy wax, Mr. Narwhal, orange, cranberry, clove, and evergreen. So pretty this is from elf again i love that snowflakes is so pretty mm, this is like a really nice clean scent evergreen man i love that stuff and then we have krampus oh i just got glitter everywhere um we have krampus marshmallow peppermint So cute. I love that a lot. Uh, oh, this smells so chocolatey. I'm trying to snort up another wax bit or deco bit. Um, it smells chocolatey. That's interesting. Marshmallow. Yeah, I'm not really getting marshmallow. I'm getting like, I'm wondering if it's supposed to smell like a fire, like melting marshmallow maybe. But maybe that mix with the marshmallow and peppermint is making it smell like chocolate. But it's like peppermint hot chocolate is what this literally smells like to me. So weird. Okay, and then Hayabusa, Hayabusa, the falcon. Um, Hayabusa. I think this is from Mulan. It's a falcon from Mulan. Rainwater, snowfall, and sea salt. Mmm, that smells so good. The sea salt and the rainwater. So yummy. So, so yummy. I'm just gonna make room for some of the other stuff in here. Sorry, I'm just like I'm trying to make room. Okay, so then what last, um, so that was a small one that I'll probably melt in the bathroom. And then this is the last of the bigger wax um, containers. I just keep falling over. Okay, and it's Fantasy Wax's Sticky Bun, Cinnamon Sugar Buttery Icing. This is one of their core scents. Super pretty. Mm. See, like they do good cinnamon scents. I'm always terrified of cinnamon scents because I don't really like like red hot cinnamon scents. But like for baked goods, they just do such a good job of making them yummy cinnamon. Like, I like cinnamon, like, to eat it. I just don't like red hot cinnamon. And I like some cinnamon, to, cinnamon scented things I've smelled in the past have not smelled so great. So, I'm excited about that one. Because I really love baked good scents like that. Okay, so then we have for the bars, Wumpa Island, Apples, Pears, Cool Coconut Milk, and Eucalyptus Sprigs from Bonus Wax. Mmm. I'm really getting the eucalyptus. With that, like, kind of fruity smell, it's really interesting and very yummy. We'll definitely go wintry with that whole eucalyptus kind of note to it tom marvolo riddle coffee ice cream i'm sad this is my last bar of this it's so good it literally smells like coffee ice cream mm, the coffee smell this is definitely one i'm gonna like save for the weekends when i'm home all day and i can just sit and enjoy a wonderful coffee smell from the morning all day long. Uh, Belmont Clan, cool cologne, succulent blood orange and black, pe pep black pepper. I'm also sad because this is my last bar of this. I got um, another one. 
Oh, it smells so yummy. Mm. Last time I melted this, it was very interesting. I want to melt it in the bedroom this time. I think I melted it in the living room last time. And I got some very interesting notes. Um, so I think I'm going to try definitely having it in the bedroom this time and see what I get. And then, of course, this is Winter Frosty Nights. Um, same as the one I had in my last video and that I showed you in the uh, empties. It is the last one of these Better Home and Gardens ones I have. Um, at least, I think think so I don't think the other ones are better home and gardens I have like a small like maybe two or three left of these clamshells from like stores um and everything so it's just a little green guy and he's just good for I don't know just like you like that uh, menthol-y minty smell like when you're sick kind of smell um there we go so this is this is her this is the wax melt basket for mid-January-ish. I think basically mid-January. So here we go. Thank you so much for watching. Please comment, like, subscribe if you enjoyed. And I will see you in the next one.